Hey guys, it's Dante here and today's video you're gonna edit with me and a scene. I have to say sorry because I wanted to bring the video after effects editor tries phone editors but I couldn't make it because like my phone goes like shit. Then I was trying to make it with an emulator but after a time I didn't find the point of it like what am I making a phone a after effects editor try phone editors and if the end of the day I'm gonna make the video on my PC so it was like and then because well I have to some exams I've been working on a lot of things this week everything I can say I'm sorry but well let's go just right to it and let's create a new composition and it will be 1920 by 1080 30 frames and seconds I just need 5 I think yeah just like that we have it like that and this the thing that i wanted did is rose well the clip that i wanted it is with rose so this part over here yeah this one i think yeah this one the first thing that we're gonna do is increase the clip so we don't see these black borders so i'm gonna put it on 34 break compose it with ctrl c ctrl c move to uh, the second option ok so i'm gonna put twixtor twixtor pro and we're gonna put the frames the same frames that our clip has and if i've done wrong it has this number if you want to check it you just go to project and where it says frame rate you will be able to see how many frames your video has all my videos that I always download has the same frame so that's why I I don't even have to check it but if you don't know there it is now speed I'm gonna change the speed oh well I'm gonna click the clock and one frame after I'm gonna put it around 40 I think that will be cool yeah I think that's enough so yeah Okay, so now the next thing we're gonna do is masking. Uh, but first of all, we're gonna pre-compose it again. The second option again. So yeah, now we got our clip, our clip that we want. That's it. Uh, now the next thing we're gonna do is masking. I know I could use the roto brush, but I think I'm gonna keep it that for a next tutorial for it because you won't understand a lot of things that I make and I see a lot of people asking that. But yeah, uh, just for this video, and I think it will take a little bit longer for it. I don't think so because the video is like not even moving at all, just a little bit moving. So I don't think it will take that longer. I hope so. <laughs> even though you will, you won't see how long it take me. I'm gonna make it faster, I think. So, well, let's see how it goes. So, yeah, as you can see, we have already our video masking. We're gonna go to our clip and gonna press M, M twice, just like that, and uh, it will open the mask options. Here in mask feather, we're gonna put it around, not too much, of course, like four or three. That's on you again, guys. The next thing we're gonna do, of course, is click the mask option here, click the clock, and we're gonna play with it until uh, the video ends. So the video is not moving that much at all, so I don't think I will have that problem. So yeah, I'm gonna start repositioning with this okay yeah i think it's cool let's see how it goes so yeah guys as you can see it goes cool now and we're gonna duplicate it with ctrl d and the one who is down we're gonna click m and we're gonna take off the mask so we have a click that 
is masking and the other one is not and we're gonna duplicate it again our mask clip so on this one we are not gonna take the the mask out uh we're gonna use it and we're gonna search in our effects uh glow aura oh by the way yeah 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 a little problem here as you can see uh when you put some effects sometimes it's like taking in the last point of the mask it won't go that that long so i recommend you to i'm gonna take down here and we're gonna to pre-compose it again yeah just like that we shouldn't have a problem now so we're again putting glow aura so yeah yeah as you can see now it doesn't have any limitations so that's cool so now we're gonna make this so follow me and uh, here on frequency we're gonna put it around 10 or 50 yeah that's cool then in saturation we're gonna put it on zero so it goes white i'm gonna increase this a little bit to i don't know 40 50 yeah just like that and now there comes the trick we're gonna add the effect edge ray so yeah it goes like that but we're gonna put this effect before the glow aura yeah just like that so well now we're open the options and we're gonna increase this thing like that and also we can control it like that uh you can uh, play around with the with the options as you can see it looks cool like this uh, i'm gonna modify it a little bit more like putting this a little bit down yeah yeah mm, what else what else can i do it yeah mm, now i'm gonna put i'm gonna click this here i'm gonna change the models and here where it says mode i'm gonna put it on overlay so as you can see it's really really soft but there are the lines you can also duplicate it if you want duplicate it again so you can see the lines a little bit like more <laughs> and you can play around with this so you don't see that much i'm gonna put it again i'm gonna check a little bit how it goes and something that we can do now is uh like the background we're gonna do a little bit the background So now we pre-compose this like that, okay. And we're gonna put it below our rose character. Okay, yeah, I like it a lot. Something else that we can do also is uh, put a little bit of blur in our video. Uh, not too much or it will look weird like five i think i'm gonna change the color of the background a little bit uh, to uh, a soft red yeah just like that i think it looks cool already yeah i like it and now you can put it like an overlay okay now i got it so i'm gonna put it this here i'm gonna increase it so it fits with the video and i'm gonna put it on overlay again oh no no scream sorry scream and change it the opacity to 20 or there not too much just something like that and I still think it is too much. Okay, I'm gonna look for another scene. I'm gonna put it on five, I think. Yeah, that's cool, I think. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like. Also, please don't forget to join to the 
thank our subscribers the special video that I'm making and leaving all the information on the description please so make sure to check it and again have a beautiful day guys I love you thank you so much for all the support you always give me and I love you so much okay see you in the next video